guys, Jesse Huntley. We're out here at Racetown 395 testing the 2012 YZ2 with the two-stroke. The motor is obviously a lot different. It's a two-stroke, so no engine braking. And I definitely kind of learned my lesson on that the first couple laps. I was OJ in some jumps and blowing over corners. So I had to get used to that, but once I got that dialed, I was I was pretty comfortable on it right away. You have to feather the clutch definitely a little bit to get it going, but once you get it going, it motors pretty good throughout the rest of the power band. And right when I go on big bikes, I've been on four strokes. So I've only ridden a two stroke big bike. I've ridden a YZ125 and a YZ250 before. It was obviously the, the 250 two strokes, pretty much the same as the last one I rode, not much different. But definitely brought back some good memories and just warming it up. It was like, you had to kind of blow the thing out. It was kind of weird, but it was, uh, I was pumped though, it was, it was good. I love two strokes, they're, they're a lot of fun, a lot funner to ride, I think, and uh, makes it more exciting. So just hearing that uh, the purring sound of a two stroke was cool, so I was pumped on it. The handling was, like it would settle kind of into the base of the corner good, and I could corner it really well, but there was a lot of high speed straightaways here, and it was, the track was really choppy and slippery today. So coming in, it would kind of, uh, I'd get head shake a lot, and it would kind of, push a little bit going in, but once, you, once it settled into a corner, it was actually cornered really well. So overall, I thought the bike was, was pretty good. It's, uh, the power band is pretty good once you get it going and um, corners well. Handles decent, so my overall impression was good. I thought the bike was a lot of fun to ride and uh, it's good.